What's going on guys? It's Bobby here at Stingray Alley and today I'm showing you a 1980 Volkswagen Rabbit. Now don't get the name confused because it's definitely not fast like one but it is definitely a cool looking car. Kind of looks like the thing made by Volkswagen. Um, it's green, it's got a tan interior in it, or brown really. Car came out of Massachusetts. It's been completely restored. Um, supposedly it's got new suspension, new springs underneath it so it drives really great. Has a new tune up. Um, fires right up and is ready to go. Convertible top, no rips or tears in it. Uh, got the rabbit emblem back there. And really it's a kind of a time capsule kind of car. I have not had one of these cars since I've started selling cars here with my dad. And my dad's been here 40 years. I've been selling cars here for going on eight, nine years. We have not come across one. I love the metal chrome bumpers in the front of the car. It gives it a nice reflection look on the lenses. But we're about to fire it up and we're gonna go take it for a test drive. So let's get everything situated so we can get going. We got our videographer over here, Itzy. She's matching the car, she loves it so well. See, look, look at the reflection right there. Now that is cool. So let's take it for a cruise, okay? It does have a dash cover on it. The dash is not cracked, as you can see. This is a four speed car. Now I do have one complaint with this car. Yeah, I don't know if you can get a picture of it down there. The pedals are extremely close. So I have pretty small feet, but look how close they are. That is the only pick I have with this car. So let's fire her up. Fires right up. Like I said, it is a four speed car. And let's go around the block. In Mexico. Yeah. With, I do have to disclaim, we are test driving in Mexico. So if you see us speeding or something like that, we are in Mexico. Disclaimer. Now this is not diesel. This is a gas powered four cylinder engine. And you know it's made by Volkswagen, so it will run forever. I lied to you guys, this is a five speed. This is a five speed transmission car. Shifts through all the gears seamlessly. Now the thing I do like about it, it is very lightweight, so turns, handles real great, brakes real great. Shift smooth, like I said. No squeaking or rattles. Unlike that 1965 Jeep that you saw right next to this car. We took that corner, we did not fly out of it. A very cool, fun get around town car. This one you can't have a blast driving it. Uh, now fifth, I'm assuming just an overgear when you get on the highway. Like I said earlier, this car is not very fast, so if you get a ticket in this car, I'm going to have to give you some props because it would be extremely hard. But if you just want something to cruise around, to work, have something fun on Sundays, something that's just different, this is definitely one. And not for a lot of money. Uh, this car is on consignment. I believe the guy wants around $15,000 for the car if I'm not mistaken which you couldn't restore one for that. I mean, you cannot take a car, you can't even get a paint job for less than five, six, seven thousand dollars now. So take that with a grain of salt for, to get a running driving 1980 Rabbit. I should have called it a turtle, honestly. It is pretty slow. But you'd be surprised how many people will call and want to come by and take pictures with this thing. I guess it's a rare find. I'm not much of a Volkswagen person myself, but it seems like everybody else in the world is. This seems like something you could take down to the beach, just have a good, nice time in, have a picnic, take your dog out. Not your girlfriend, but your actual dog. Maybe your girlfriend too. You both have a good time. But here's one last walk around of it while it's running. Emergency brake does work. Now this does have the original Volkswagen engine to it. So it's the original four cylinder that came with it. Uh, running strong, like I said, 
it reads 80,000, um, 84,000 miles on or something like that. Yeah, 84,000, one miles. We put one mile on it on that test drive. Tires look great, paint looks great. Um, not really any picks on it. So come by, come check it out. It is fuel injected, if you guys couldn't tell. It's not carbureted. So come by, come check it out. We will get you going. Bye.